Step 1. Gather dirt and then mark the spawn point by building a pillar of dirt. Step 2. Find some trees and hit them with your hand to collect 20 wood blocks. Step 3. Craft logs into planks using a 2x2 crafting grid in the inventory. Then make a crafting table from 4 wood planks and place it on the ground. Step 4. Craft sticks and use sticks in the previously crafted planks to craft a pickaxe, an axe, a sword, and a shovel. Step 5. Find a hill and use your pickaxe to collect 20 blocks of cobblestone. Step 6. Craft stone tools and weapons. Step 7. Gather another 20 blocks of wood using your stone axe instead of your hand. Step 8. Kill some animals with your stone sword and then collect the items they drop. Step 9. Using wool and wood planks, craft a bed to sleep through the night. Step 10. Use the crafting table to craft a furnace using 8 cobblestone blocks and then place it down. Step 11. Mine coal, which is found on the side of mountains, putting the majority in the furnace while keeping the rest for later use. Step 12. Place the raw meat gathered earlier into the furnace to cook. Step 13. Find a large cliffside digging 11 blocks in using a pickaxe. Then, carve a large square of 10 blocks on all sides. Step 14. Using the crafting table, craft the door and place it in front of the carved room. Step 15. Using a crafting table, place sticks with coal on top to create torches. Then, place those torches inside of the room to prevent mob spawning. Step 16. Craft a chest and then move the crafting table, bed, and furnace inside of the 10x10 10 10 room. Step 17. Mine iron, which is most commonly found below sea level. Step 18. Place the iron in a furnace. Using the smelted iron, create a new set of tools, flint and steel, a bucket, some shears, 
armor, and a shield. Step 19. Find a deep cave and go to Y level negative 53. Mine at least 29 diamond ore. Step 20. Using a crafting table, craft diamond armor, a diamond sword, and a diamond pickaxe. Using a diamond pickaxe, mine 14 obsidian blocks for founding caves. Step 21. Create another portal using the 14 obsidian blocks and put them in a circular shape. After entering the portal, build a box of cobblestone around the portal to protect it. Step 22. Using a non-nether native block, create a path to find your way back to the portal. Step 23. Once locating a nether fortress, find blazes and kill them until you have 12 blaze rods. Step 24. Find piglins and use gold to trade for ender pearls. Step 25. Craft the blaze rods into blaze powder and use the blaze powder and the ender pearls you have to craft eyes of ender. Step 26. In the overworld, use the eyes of ender to locate the stronghold. Step 27. Dig down to the stronghold and find the end portal and use the remaining eyes to fill in the ender portal. Step 28. Enter the end portal and blow up end crystals using the hands or tools you have. Step 29. Wait for the dragon to perch down in the bedrock center and wait to attack it. Step 30. Enter the new end portal. Congratulations. 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 You beat Minecraft.